Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 1 July 2022. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly senior writer Cameron McKay writes that batteries and decentralized power are seen as the key way to boost security of supply. Industry body, the South African Energy Storage Association, emphasizes the importance of a decentralized power system and the benefits it can provide, and how this can be supported using battery energy storage systems in the local market. The engineering news features focus on pipes, tubes and hoses, where a pipe supply project is successfully completed. Consulting engineers, where industry body CETA challenges Sanral's decision to cancel infrastructure tenders and a special focus on battery energy storage, where a company aims to triple its battery and solar energy storage electronics capacity. The Mining Weekly features focus on gold, where the remainder of 2022 holds many potential demand outcomes for the industry. And pumps, where a supplier replaces the pump seals at a coal mine. This week's business leader is Lusanda Rapulu, Head of Dispute Resolution at Bowman's. And as this week's cartoon shows, the electricity crisis has been casting a confidence sapping shadow over the South African economy for nearly 15 years. The chickens of ESCOM problems have been roosting for some time and have been joined more recently by acts of criminal sabotage. As such, load shedding has intensified and is poised to become far worse unless urgent and decisive action is taken. We hope you enjoyed this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly, the magazine that offers you news about developments in the real economy. Happy reading and see you next time.